Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Unlock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSC Mathematics Class 7 Chapter 24 Area and Perimeter Exercise 24F Question Number 1. This is find the area of each circle in question 1 take pi 3 whole 1 by 7 or 22 by 7 and in question 2 take pi 3.14 right so basically we have to find the area of the circle now how do we find the area of a circle so there's a very simple formula for that so area of the circle right equals to what uh, pi right so first of all pi and then into radius right into radius and again into radius fine so two times we will be multiplying it with it so area equals to pi into r square or simply we can say pi r square right so this we get that means we need to know the value of pi that we already know that will be given in the question and then second thing we need to know is the value of the radius right the radius of the circle so see here what have we got in the first part the radius is already given right that is 14 centimeters so area equals to um, pi r square right so 22 by 7 into 14 into 14 right cancel this cancel this so that will become 22 into 28 right that will be what so let's see 22 and 28 right 616 and what unit square centimeters right this becomes the area in the first one now second we've got the diameter right simply d 56 centimeters so again here we will convert diameter into radius right this is very important because in the question we have radius into radius right so first we need to convert this into the diameter there is formula with the diameter also but that will become a very time taking process right so first of all let's solve this way only okay 56 upon 2 right this will give us the radius that will be 28 centimeters right this is the radius now again area equals to pi r square so pi 22 into r square 28 into 28 right cancel this cancel this 4 so um, what what does this become 8 into 4 30 22 into 32 and 3 4 2 8 112 right this is uh, this is going to give us what 224 and then 224 right so let's do the multiplication so 112 and 20 so this will become 2464 square centimeters right so this becomes the answer now let's move on to the next part now next part is what so third one again here we have diameter that is diameter is 2 whole 4 by 5 meters so that will become what 14 by 5 meters right convert that to a improper to an improper fraction fine now the diameter divide this by 2 so 14 by 5 divided by 2 that will be 14 by 5 into 1 by 2 why are we dividing by 2 because we want the radius right so this will give us 7 by 5 this is the radius right now what more do we want radius we know and again value of pi is going to be 22 by 7 right so area equals to uh, sorry pi r square that is 22 by 7 into r square so radius 7 by 5 into 7 by 5 right cancel this cancel this nothing else can be cancelled okay so 7 into 4 uh, 7 into 2 14 and 1 into 2 14 and 1 154 by 25 right this is what we will get and this thing cannot be cancelled right so let's convert this to an improper fraction 
so that will give us what four five six right six whole four by twenty five right you can do it mentally or you can do the division also and put the unit square meters right so this becomes the area now let's move on to the next part right so the fourth one here what have we got so here simply the radius is given to us that is one whole three by four right one whole three by four centimeters that will be seven by four centimeters right convert the mixed fraction to the improper fraction so this becomes the radius now area let's calculate the area that will be pi r square okay so 22 by 7 into 7 by 4 into 7 by 4 right this way we'll do this so cancel that cancel that cancel this cancel this 2 11 right can we answer it anymore no right so this will become what 7 into 4 77 and then upon 4 into 2 8 again convert this mixed for action uh, improper fraction to the mixed fraction so that will become what 9 whole 5 by 8 okay 9 whole and 72 so 77 5 by 8 and put the unit square centimeters right always convert improper fraction to the mixed fraction for the final for the last one right don't leave it as improper fraction and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourselves and bye